Hey everybody, it's Kelly Williams with the Kelly Williams Show and Bay Area Houston Magazine. And it's time for the Kelly Williams Show! Woo! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Alright, so I am so excited because we are live right now at Cajun Eats in Kima, Texas. And I'm going to tell you, I can't wait because we're going to get to taste some amazing, amazing Cajun food. Yeah. Right, guys? Yeah. It. So I'm here with these amazing guys right here, Jared Dupree Hi, and Chance Gonzalez. Yeah. Hey, guys. How you doing? Hello. Are you bringing the fire? Oh, we're bringing that fire, girl. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, I want to, let's find out a little bit about y'all because um, I'm, I'm thinking this is the place that everybody's going to want to come eat Cajun food. I agree. Yeah, I do too. So, Jared, where are you from? So I'm from New Iberia, Louisiana. Lived nice. In, lived in Karen Crow, that's where I went to high school. Nice. You know, I'm from Lake Charles, y'all. Oh, okay. Place. All right. Yeah. Right down the road. Yeah, LC. that's right. That's LC. right. <laughs> so how long now are you living in this area now? I am. I'm living right now in League City, and uh, I've been here for about four years. Okay. And you still got that accent. Yeah. I like it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, shad. Yeah, that's right. That's it. <laughs> okay, Chance, where are you from? I'm originally from uh, New Iberia, Louisiana, uh, but I live uh, right now in Willis, Texas, on Lake Conroe. Nice. Yeah, the berry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got a couple of Louisiana boys right here who know what Cajun food is supposed to taste like and how to make it. And, okay, <laughs> did, did y'all always want to own a restaurant? No. Never. No, no not, not well, me. Okay, tell how did it start? Did you just wake up one day and go, I want some good Cajun food and I'm going to start my own place? No, so like I actually worked in the oil field. Um, had a little food truck there that I had opened up because every time I went home to Louisiana, it was like, oh, bring me this, bring me that. <laughs> Got laid off. Yeah. I uh, brought the food truck back to Louisiana and opened it up, and pff, here we are almost three years later just rocking and nice. rolling. Loving it. Never thought in a million years I'd be doing this. Yeah. But I love to cook. That's excellent. <laughs> are these all homemade recipes? or? Uh, yes, what? most of them. Most of everything we have except for our french fries in our okay. ranch. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jared, right. did you... Um, y'all, tell me about your. This is a family affair. So right. tell, tell me how it's family. <laughs> hey, mom. <laughs> <laughs> tell me how it's family. So, his wife and my wife are first cousins, and uh, we met about three years ago. Yeah. And uh, so yeah, we're family. We, we're, whenever there's a reunion or a family get, uh, Christmas get together or Easter, we there. That's it. Yeah. That's it. That's, That's it. Right. That's right, Shaq. Okay, Jared, did you always? think that you would own a, a, a food truck a restaurant i mean ne- never that's a lot of work yeah it is and never a food truck uh restaurant i was like eh, but i always want to have my own business yeah and uh in, in 2020 with covid i was like I, same thing i got laid off and uh i went home to visit my mom and when i went home to visit my mom chance had the food truck open so i went and we are like one of everything we had beef jerky i mean we had all kind of stuff and uh, we it was, i remember it was 167 dollars i was like i will because me and my mom <laughs> I mean, that's Cajun right there. Oh, yeah. That's it. So, that's it. So we sit now, we just, look, we eat and we mange, right? So, look, I'm, I'm just like, I'm like, Mama, I'm like, she's like, wow, this stuff's really good. I was like, the swamp fries, I mean, we're just going crazy. The next day, I called him, I said, dude, I said, I was living in Texas, but I was visiting Louisiana. I said, dude, I said, we got to open a food truck in Texas, in Kima, Texas. And he was like, come on, let's do it. Nice. So, yeah. Nice. I like it. So, how old is Cajun Eats? So, it started in uh, 2019, uh, June of 2019. Okay. So, almost four years old? Yeah, in June. Wow. June of May, four years. Congratulations, guys. Thank you. That's amazing. Very blessed, for sure. Yeah, Absolutely. that is that is awesome. Um, okay. So, you know, this is a, a family-oriented business, and your faith is is very important to both of you. Yes, right. Um, Absolutely. So tell us how it, it affects your business and your life. Yeah, I mean, for me, I mean, I, I, I give all glory to God and just where I'm at now, if, if it wouldn't be for him, I wouldn't be here at all, obviously. And uh, yeah, I mean, we do the same thing. We pray, uh, we believe, and uh, we bring the community in and we do the same thing. We pray and believe with them. So that's, that, for, my, for me, for my business and with Chance, that's, that's what it is for me. Yes. I love that. Multiple times I'll just walk around the truck and just rub my hand, along, my hand along the truck and just bless the truck, you know, that everything inside the truck nourishes our bodies and everything that we serve all this good food to beautiful people. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Amen. Amen. Um, okay, so we are about to taste some of this amazing food and I know you want some really bad because I can't wait to eat some. Finger so, looking good. That's right. It, is, it looks, I can't wait. So tell us the four things really quickly that we're going to taste today. Okay, so 
We have some crawfish boudin balls. Oh my goodness. All right, we have jalapeno cream cheese boudin balls. These oh. are amazing. Yeah, oh then we got our boudin grilled cheese, which is <gasps> off the chain. Oh my goodness. And then this right here is our Cajun fries, which is a mixture of a boudin chicken and sausage, a mixture that we have that we came up with. Okay, oh yeah. my gosh. Okay, so what are we gonna taste first? Come on. I'm ready. We'll Give leave it. Some. We'll leave it up to you. Okay. Yeah. Let's, let's take some of the crawfish balls first. Okay, that right. they looked phenomenal. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I know you're. You tell me not to eat it with a fork, but we're going to ah, split ah, it so we no. can all have some. This is amazing. I'm on a diet. Oh, <laughs> Seafood diet. My hands are clean. There you go. Seafood. All right. Okay. So you pick these up. Now, what is that sauce? Oh yeah. Chance. So, I'm, I'm gonna let Chance do, look, okay, go with the, the, all, the sauce. Look at this. This is amazing oh. how delicious oh. does that look oh, i can't wait to eat it so what's the sauce so our sauce is called our fire sauce fire so sauce. It's, it started as a crawfish dipping sauce is mm -hmm. what it's really made for mm -hmm. so made it people love it and then mm -hmm. whenever like i said got laid off i started making my own sauce i knew people um everybody has their own different uh things on it so i knew oh. i had to make it my own and it took me a while it took me about six months had Sauce everywhere all over the house. Oh. Wife wanted to kill me, but we got it, girl. Okay, I'm, I'm tasting the, the fire. The fire. fire right and the name here. came from there. Everybody was like, man, this is so good. This is fire. And I was like, mm -mm. fire, fire sauce. sauce. Mm -mm. That's where it's at. Oh. Mm, manger, girl. Mm. <laughs> mm. <sighs> Unbelievable. This is incredible. Okay, come on, y'all. Y'all need to be. All right, all right. All right yeah. Incredible, seriously. I'm gonna put mine on top. Yeah, just, that's what I'm saying. It's a fire. My, my mouth's yeah. Fire. yeah. This is good. Oh my goodness. Mm. This is craziness. Mm. How long does it take to make these? Mm. Mm. Hmm? Seven minutes. What? So you drop them in the basket. Oh. Mm -mm. So they're ready to eat. Mm. Yeah, but how do you so good. how do you make them? Are they a the secret? Take all the boudin and stuff, we add the crawfish stand in. Hmm. Come stop. Like that. There's always a secret to Cajun food. There is always. A secret. Always. <laughs> no recipe, just add. <laughs> These are a little hot. They're good. I love spicy food. She needs her coffee. Thank you. I gotta have my drink. <laughs> all right. Thank you, producer Shelly. All right. <laughs> this stuff is amazing. Incredible, seriously, incredible. So, two come in one order, is that right? Correct. Correct. Okay. Can you get bigger orders? Oh yeah, yeah absolutely. We do um, so like a, a like a 16 inch pan would usually comes with about 20 20 oh. boudin balls in it. So yeah. you can mix them up however you like. Oh my, incredible. Yes. So these are just the regular crawfish balls. Yes, correct. Okay. So I want to taste the. Let's do the. Boudin grilled cheese. Oh, yeah. yes. oh, this is one of my this is yes. one of my favorites. Mm -mm. It's probably one of my favorites. And here at Cajunese Kima, it is our number one seller. Oh. So I bet yummy. Oh it, it is. Yummy. It's incredible. I can't wait. Oh my oh my goodness. This is craziness. Grilled cheese is so Yo, good. Y'all, first I of all, I love cheese. grilled cheese. Yes, me too. This looks incredible. Look at this, guys. Oh my god. That's goodness. the cheese. Okay, come on, y'all. Mm. Okay, so what what is in this? Boudin, just boudin cheese. Oh, mm. <laughs> c'est bon. Ça c'est bon. This should not be legal. <laughs> mm. <laughs> mm. This is incredible. This is. Uh, and I know I don't just say it just because it's mm -mm. it's our recipe, this but is, it's good. Mm, 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 oh, mm, mm. Best boudin around, one hundred. This is mm. incredible. Mm. Okay, so how long does it take you if I come drive down and? I'm so um so boudin grilled cheese, cheese uh, five minutes. We we'll drop the fries and it just comes with a side of fries. Oh my goodness! Oh my. Yes, we can have that. Pretty pretty quick. Y'all. But so tasty, right? <laughs> y'all. Y'all. And this is uh, this is crazy good. Thank you. Um, okay, so uh, let's taste some of those uh, fries. Awesome. Cajun fries. Oh my gosh, this is oh, yeah. unbelievable. So this is gonna be a. Uh, uh -oh. That's, that's gonna be a good one. Okay, so Cajun fries, how'd y'all come up with this? What's this from? So, I don't really remember how it all started, but oh, I, I'm, a big chick, I'm a big chicken fan, mm -hmm. love smoked sausage. Yeah. So I take, we took uh, chicken thighs, cooked it down, shredded it up, onions and bell peppers, sauteed everything with butter and everything. Threw our smoked sausage, then I just threw our boudin in there and I just oh. mixed it all up. Oh my goodness. And payao. 
There we go. Fire. Fire. We got that fire. Yeah. You got the fire, (laughs) chef. And then on the fries, we put it on the fries. You can do it on macaroni. I mean, there's there's multiple Uh, items. We do little uh quesadillas with it. It's so good. Look at this. Then put that ranch. It's incredible. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. (laughs) Where am I? She's hooked. Yeah. This is crazy. This stuff is unbelievable. Yeah, it's I'm very, glad very, you very, like it. And it's not it's like it's just a bunch of fries covered with stuff. You can actually taste, taste ev- everything. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Correct. There you Absolutely. go. This is oh. amazing. Okay, so it's the it's your Cajun sauce and then a little bit of ranch. Yes, and cheese. Fire sauce. And cheese okay, come on, y'all. Huh. Okay. Right. Oh my. Yeah. This is. I ain't gonna tell crazy. you no, girl. <laughs> this is crazy, y'all. Mm. If you have not been to Cajun Eats in Kima. Yet, mm. you better mm. come on mm. down. Mm. You will uh, cheer it's, it's, it's awesome. Oh my gosh. First, like when, when someone comes to the window, mm. they always ask whoever's mm-hmm. taking orders, well, what's your favorite or what do you like? And I always tell them, go for the Cajun mix. Oh my gosh. Look, catfish, shrimp, everything, Boone, it's all great. The Boone grilled cheese is number one seller. But the Cajun mix, to me, is the most flavorful thing we have on the truck. It's amazing. It really is. This is a great, I mean, this is a meal for like two or three people. It it really could be, or unless you're really, really, really hungry. No, exactly. (laughs) I mean, this is unbelievable food. This is so delicious. I can't even get over it. I'm not kidding. Thank you. I am funny, and so is producer Shelly, about anything Cajun, because that's what we all grew up on. Correct. Um, Gumbos, you know, duck, chicken, whatever it is, shrimp, I mean, seafood, You there's a taste and a quality you expect. Right. Yes, ma'am. When, you eat right. anything, when anything has Cajun on it. Right, on the exactly. Name. Yep, and everything we have is all cooked fresh. Oh, so I love that. So it's nothing we don't cook anything and have it sitting on the side and wait for everything's cooked no. to order. Yep, made to Unbelievable. Yep. Unbelievable. Yes, Unbelievable. Absolutely. Okay, so let's taste uh, jalapeno cream cheese boudin ball. That's my favorite. Okay, come on. Yeah, here we go. Here That's we go. my favorite. Let's see. Producer Shelly, let's look at this. And we don't have... Oh, my gosh. Yeah, we do the, the by tennis uh, ball size boudin ball. So they're, they're not the little sm- no, small boudin ball. No, this is amazing. So you can, so one, it, it'll come in order of two. Correct. Or you can order as many as you, you want. Can, you and can it's order, all yeah. made fresh. Correct. To order. Yes, Okay, ma'am. so come on, guys. And they do have, I'm gonna like do, I said, I'm going to do a Cajun style. Whenever your, that's whenever it. Your, whenever your, mom, whenever your mama passes that to you, she's like, here, boy, eat that. Here, eat that, boy. Okay, I've got my little sauce in my bowl. So, and then, like, we, as you can tell, it does have the jalapeno inside. Mm-hmm. Some people think that they're, they're real spicy. Oh, oh. But what's good about it is just a slice. So, you can mm-hmm. actually take it and take it out if you would like, you know. But it gives but it. But I don't. Yeah. Mm. It's cooked in there. And so, it gives it that good jalapeno flavor. Mm-hmm. Not a little spice. With the cream it's not cheese. too hot. Oh, my goodness. This is, y'all, I'm sorry. This is crazy good. Don't you That's wish my you were favorite. here with us? Because mm-hmm. I'm telling you, you want to come down to Cajun mm-hmm. Eats. That's this, right. This stuff is unbelievable. Mm. That's my favorite. Oh my gosh. This is a very common reaction, by the way. Yeah. When people eat yeah. this stuff for the first time, they're like, I've, I can't tell you how many times I've seen, heard people tell me, this is the best boonet ball I've ever oh. had, or this is the best floated fries I've ever had, or this is the best grilled cheese I've ever had. It just really is good. I'm not just saying it because mm-hmm. it's our food truck. This food is amazing. Yeah, this is uh, this stuff is unbelievable, guys. I'm telling you, off the charts. Okay, so what's our last thing that we're gonna taste? Oh, well, that's it. That's it. That's no, the fourth. There's one more thing in there. Oh, you can have more of that one. Oh, there's the boudin ball. <laughs> yeah. Which those, one you want? Those four oh, things. No, Which that's right. That's right. You know what? You know what? I think you want more of the Cajun fries. That's I think probably I want what it more is. everything. <laughs> yeah. This is so, y'all. This is yeah. unbelievable. Mm-mm. Oh my gosh. Okay. So. How fun is it to have a food truck with really good food? Right, so it's fun. I, I mean, tell you what, I like since uh, so of course, like I started in Karen Crow. Big shout out to them because that's where Cajun Eats yep. blew up for me. Mm-hmm. Definitely a blessing. Once I got here to Conroe, uh, man, I met so many people over here, like so much like love and support. And man, we just go in there, and we have a good time. We play the Cajun Zodico music and stuff, and and party. Have a fade do do. Fredo. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, Jared, how are you loving? What made you decide to open, put your food truck in Kima? For me, it's just the. I mean, the first of all, the community has been super supportive. I mean, everybody around here, and I'm not just talking about just Kima. Yeah. Uh, and I'll get to that in a second. But everybody around Kima, Galveston, League City, Dickinson, I mean, everybody. But yeah. to be here in Kima, 
I don't know. I just like the laid back yeah. feeling that you get whenever you come to Kima. Everybody's super, super friendly and even more important, supportive. Absolutely. So it's, that, that's the main reason why I like it here. And especially being here at the bubble at bubble jungle, yeah. it's a it's a family feel to this place. So I want, I want everybody to understand where you're located. You're located yeah, at the bubble jungle in their little area, open area. Correct. So bubble jungle is actually people. A lot of people don't know this, but bubble jungle is actually a food truck park. Mm. It's a food truck park and bar. So the what? thing about it is, is that there's two separate parts. There's a food truck part and then there's a bar area. And it's like I said, super friendly, Gosh, super so family oriented. <laughs> and we're three blocks down from the boardwalk. So yeah. Real easy. You can park somewhere and walk. Exactly. Right to this. Yep. And um, and then and what's great is that this little area has mm. hammocks and games and yes, all kind of things. You can come hang out. Yeah. And a lot of benches. You can come <laughs> hang out, eat, and enjoy yourself and just enjoy a great evening outside and eating some great Asian yes, food. Absolutely. Um, absolutely. Okay. So I want to know what do y'all think. The best thing about owning Cajun Eats has been for both of you. Just the the, the whole deal of being able to travel because we do like um, a lot of events from uh, all the way went to all the way to Alabama already to all the way to towards San Antonio. Just the the deal of being out there and just meeting the people and getting the reactions of things that we created that God created yeah. and had us serve out is just it's amazing. It I is that's it. probably the the best thing I love of the people that we meet and the love and support that we get from everybody. I love That's that. where it's at, 100%. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. I mean, for me, it's it's the customers, the support of the customers. I mean, whenever people come in, we have our regulars, you know, people come in once, twice, sometimes three times a week, and they're just like, uh, yeah, man, I'm, I'm going to try something different. I'm going to do art. Sometimes I have people, they want order. They'll just come just to talk. Yep. And that is what's amazing to me is that it's just them just to come just to talk. And, uh, you know, being able to, to maybe to pray for them or just encourage them. I mean, just hug them and, and just talk about whatever, you know, yeah. talk about their day at work. So that for me, that's what it is. The customers and just meeting new people like Chance was saying. It's, just, it's amazing. So sweet. Yeah. What are the hours here? So the hours are right, actually right here. And if you look here, we Wednesday and Thursday from 4 to 8 p.m. Friday and Saturday, 4 to 10 p.m. And then Sunday, 1 p.m. to 8 p.m. Excellent. Excellent. What do you, how many items do you have on, on the menu? Well, that's always a, a big thing. We actually, our actual menu is about what, 40 to 50 items? Yes. Wow. <laughs> so we have like, a lot of secret menu items. Yes. Yeah, so like I started coming up with stuff and I, so the menu that we have here and then the menu I have in Conroe, we just, we have probably a whole nother menu that's not even, that we don't serve every day. Wow. So we kind of just take these items, come up with certain things and we just take it in like, oh, this week we can have a limited item. That week we got this. Yep. You know, so I'm actually working on all kind of new things right now as well. I love it. Yes. How did y'all decide what your basic menu was going to be? So that, That's pretty hard. So I love, I love french fries. Yeah. I love... <laughs> I love macaroni and cheese, so <laughs> oh that's gosh. where it came for me. So that's what, like, yeah. in, in Louisiana, that's yeah. what we're known for. A loaded mac, loaded fries. Yeah. That's where it's at. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Like, we, like for us, like, we, Chance and I always talk about the, the, the main menu, like, what we're always going to have at Cajun Eats, and then we just do special. Like, this weekend, we took the Cajun mix, and we, we put it on pasta. We did pasta laya. So that was our special for this past weekend. So for our truck, that's what we do. We do a lot. We're going to do a weekend special every weekend and put those things on special. But we have the menu that we have right now. It is sort of limited. But like I said, we're going to start rotating all of the items in as we go. Yeah. I think it's a great menu, though. Okay. I mean, it may be limited to y'all, but there's a lot of variety here. Correct. This and there's like, amazing. there's like, a, you know, some small items, if the, like the boudin balls, yeah. if you just want to appetize or if you're really hungry. Exactly. You can get the loaded fries. And then we actually have another one. It's called the Fado Do fries, which is boudin chicken and shrimp on it. So you, oh. it's actually something that you can actually share. Like, you, Oh, my goodness. Yeah. So it's, it's our a, a biggest share? item. That's what <laughs> I right. say. That's what I <laughs> I mean, okay, so really quickly, y'all, I know you probably can see this, but this is the fry. What are these? That's the Cajun fries. Cajun, Cajun fries. fries. Look at this. They are incredible. Um, everything has been unbelievable. Thank you. How do they follow y'all on social media? So we're, we're all over us. Facebook, Instagram. Uh, we do TikTok stuff. I mean, Snapchat. Uh, we do have a website, CajunEats.shop. So it's K-A-J-U-N-E-A-T-Z dot shop. So you can find all of us. Uh, we have shirts. We have hats. We got all of our sauces, seasonings, uh, hot sauces, the whole nine yards. We're actually working on a mustard barbecue sauce and a marinade as we speak no. right now. Yes. That's awesome. Yes. 
So we're excited about that. I, I'm very excited about that. <laughs> and of course, uh, of course, we do have separate pages because yes. each location has their own. So exactly. go to uh, Facebook, Cajunese Kima. If you're around um, Conroe, Cajunese Conroe. Well, they need to follow both of y'all. Right. Correct. All of it. All yes. Of it. Um, okay, so guys, I, I mean, I don't even know what to say anymore. This food is. She's Unbelievable. speechless. Unbelievable. <laughs> it's incredible. Got it. Got it. If you want real Cajun food from two real Cajuns. Some Cuyos. That's right. Two good old Louisiana boys. You need to come to Cajun Eats Chemo or you can go to Cajun Eats in Conroe. Yes, That's right. Right? Two locations. And this has been incredible. I'm really excited for y'all. This is this is huge. Thank you. Absolutely. Um, you know, I, 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 I'm, I mean, just I'm being honest with you. You know, being a Louisiana girl, you look for any place. That's right. That has <laughs> that, leaves, that, that has Cajun stuff, and you you can't wait to taste it. Yeah. Um, for sure. And it's not always what you're expecting. Um, this is this is real Cajun food. This is the good old stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And right that's here. that's another thing too is I know we have a lot of like. What we call like the comfort foods, okay, but we also yeah. do our the, the, the classics. That's right. Etouffee, That's right. gumbo, red beans and rice with, with tenders on the side. I mean, what? we do all the favorites, yeah. the jambalaya. Yeah. Oh. So we have all of that too. Yeah. So that, that's another thing yeah. too you got to keep in mind when you come in. Everybody, a lot of people come in like, well, you have etouffee? Yep, we got etouffee because that's wow. the traditional Cajun meals. Yeah. And then we have the comfort food yeah. uh, line too. So, so we kind of do like the ca- Cajun food with a twist, but we also have our Cajun traditional stuff because we keep it where we came from. Yeah, I, love I love it. Yes. Okay, so I want y'all to end the show by both saying something uh, Cajun. <laughs> oh, hey, comment ça marche, eh? Lapin. Lapin, hey, lapin. That's it. <laughs> lapin day is coming up. All right. That's it, yeah. <laughs> lapin day is coming up, easy. All right. Yeah, so, uh, so thank yeah. y'all for bringing the fire yeah. today. Good old food right here at Cajun Eats. We are at the Kima location. That's right. Um, it's right here in the bubble jungle on Kip Avenue in Kima. And there's a location if you are up in the Conroe area. You can look up Cajun Eats and go see them as well. That's but, right. Um, guys, this has been amazing. Amazing, amazing. Yes, I can't even you. say We're, we're going to finish eating a bunch of good Cajun food. Yeah. So, um, okay, guys. <laughs> so, Shad, you better get down here. Okay. Uh Thank you so much for watching the Kelly Williams show today. We have had so much fun with Jared and Chance today at Cajun Eats Kima, yes. eating some good old Cajun food. And uh, you can watch the Kelly Williams show every week on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. And uh, we hope you have an awesome and blessed rest of your day. We'll see you Y'all soon. Come on down, chef. <laughs> <laughs>